Well, it's a long time since I've seen this hotel. So we booked an Uber taxi. Uber taxis operate here in Dubai, by the way. So it's quite useful. But he's got lost coming here. Should be coming down here. We were supposed to be about four minutes away. We've been 20 minutes waiting for him. And you can see on the Uber, he's just driving around trying to find this place. And it, the, the hotel uh, lobby guy says it's very well known. Oh Lord, what is going on? Just lots of people sat down in the middle of the street down there because of the mosque. All these guys going to the mosque, my taxi is now one hour late. They just all sat out in the middle of the road. I do get it. I understand, but my lord. So our driver's arrived, taking us to the hotel. Thank you very much. That didn't take long. <laughs> so the Ubi here in Dubai is a little bit different to uh, other places. It's a little more luxurious. Can we go the, the beach road, the front road? Okay. Today Michelle and I are going to a very special hotel indeed and uh, we're quite looking forward to it aren't we? Yeah, yes. I'm going to call this the best hotel in the world. To me, that's what it, it sort of uh, signifies. Now I've said to you many times before uh, when people ask about what do we love about travelling, it's all about the people you meet rather than the places you go or, you know, the places you go, if they really mean something to you, and this place does mean something to Michelle and I. Continue straight down your destination. Let me on the left. So well, we've arrived. Thank, Thank you very much. <laughs> so have you guessed yet? This is going to be such a blast. Look at this place. A little look. We'll, we'll check that out in a minute. We better we better check in first. Well, it's a long time since I've seen this hotel. This, to me, is got to be one of the best hotels in the world. Michelle and I have just rocked up here. I'm really looking forward to staying here. Do you want to see it? Do you want to see it? Has anyone guessed? You've probably seen it in the title. Here she is. The QE2, Queen Elizabeth II. This ship used to f sail from the Solent, Southampton, the Solent, to New York, if I remember rightly. And it's now based here in Dubai. We're in Dubai for a few days, so we're going to stay in the QE2. I'm so excited, Michelle's excited. Here she is. What was your name? Chakra. Chakra. Yes. Hi, Chakra. Hello. Now, Chakra <laughs> is from Indonesia, so we've got matching. Yeah, uh, my, I have one as Matching well. colors, <laughs> matching bracelets, the Indonesian colors. So we're on the first floor, and it goes the other way around. So five is the the lower deck. Four, three, two, one. So breakfast. Just below, just below the quarter deck, the upper deck, boat deck, sun deck. Signal deck. Okay. So welcome aboard the QE2. Okay. So here she is guys. Queen Elizabeth II. A lot of history. We'll actually be doing a tour. I'll take you around with us. Um, explain a bit about the history of the QE2 and explain to you a little bit about our history with the QE2. It's not uh, a strong link, but it's a fairly strong link. Ah. We have a Circle K on the QE2. How bizarre. Okay. Nice. So we're okay. Okay, we'll get our bags in and I'll show you around the room. The telephone number there, if you need anything, just dial zero. 
to control the TV, you can just operate here. Okay. And over here we have set the faucet box. It's mentioned here how to use it. Over here for the bathroom. For the, you know, like for the sheet, we have buttons like here. Okay. Nice bathroom. Get to your portal. And we've got a lovely, a lovely ocean view or sea view. It's quite surreal, isn't it? Never thought I'd be on the QE2 and now I'm on the QE2. It's stationary, but it's still floating. And uh, it's beautiful, nice big room. Welcome, dear Stephen Owens. Whether this is your first QE2 experience or a nostalgic return to this world's famous ocean liner, on behalf of the entire team, thank you for choosing to stay with us. Kind regards, Yanal Abasa, General Manager. What sort of room is this, Michelle? It's a superior room with sea view. Superior room. For those of you that are going to our superior room with sea view, they're a little bigger uh, than I think the standard room. And of course, we've asked to be on a high floor and we've got a sea view. So we get that feeling that we're on a boat. Yeah, it feels like a boat, huh? Very special boat, mind you. Till it leads you back home. find that the answer is yes. The QE2. It's quite emotional really to, to look at a boat like this, up this close, know that Michelle and I are staying on it and know that we have some history with it in so much as this